Hello, you're welcome to Express Updates. My name is Yaira Auna. Stay tuned. In our first story, effective Friday, March 1st, 2024, the balance and transaction limits of customers' mobile money wallets will be revised upward by the Bank of Ghana. This development comes after evolving customer needs and increasing trends of transactional activities. A statement from the Ghana Chamber of Telecommunications disclosed that customers with a minimum account, which initially had a limit of 2,000 Ghana cities, has been upgraded to 3,000 Ghana cities. Also, medium accounts with a current limit of 10,000 Ghana cities has been increased to 15,000 Ghana cities, adding to the daily transaction limits. An enhanced account with a threshold of 15,000 Ghana cities has been reviewed to 25,000 Ghana cities daily. According to the statements, the medium, maximum, and enhanced accounts of customers with transaction limits have been reviewed accordingly. However, medium and enhanced accounts of customers which had no limits on the value of monthly transactions remain unchanged. For further clarification, management urges the public to reach out to the chamber's personnel. For further clarification, management urges the public to reach out to the chamber's personnel at any of their customer service centers across the country. In recent times, various parts of the country have experienced intermittent power outages. The Public Utilities and Regulatory Commission has attributed this to insufficient fuel supply. The Commission is taking steps to engage the independent power producers to find long-lasting solutions. The Deputy Energy Minister-designate, Collins Adoma Comensa, has expressed government's commitment to resolving the power disruptions within the next two weeks. In other developments, the former Power Minister, Dr. Kwabina Donko, disputed President Akufado's accession in Parliament that there has been uninterrupted power supply for the past seven years. The Minister-designate, acknowledging the recent power outages, reiterated that government is fully committed to address in the issue. In a viral video circulating on social media, it was seen that a Toyota Hiace minibus was attacked on the Kumasi Accra Highway. From the CCTV footage, it was revealed that the driver of the attacked bus displayed a high level of competence and bravery. In the process, he calmed the passengers while he sped off the robbery zone. The attacked bus is one of the 2M Express Company Limited. Management of the transport service provider is yet to issue Jesus. an official communique on the incident. Jesus, Jesus. Go, go, go. And that's all we have for you on Express Updates. My name is Yaira Auno. Enjoy the rest of your day.